Filipinas, ladies, if you've never dated a black guy before, allow me to introduce myself. My name is The Good Doc, Dr. Mike TV, and in this video, I'm going to explain to you a couple of reasons why I think you should date a black guy. Let's go ahead and get into it. Number one, black men, more specifically black American men, in reference to those that travel to the Philippines, are probably in the lowest percentile of humanly possible. So imagine if you only have one in every foreigner that travels to the country, one in every 100 is African American, guess what? Your opportunity to experience us is going to be very slim to none. So why would you pass up such a rare opportunity to be with somebody who looks like us? Imagine, I already know that many of you like us because we can sing, we can dance, and we can play basketball. That doesn't necessarily mean that all of us can sing and dance and play basketball, but we probably look like we can sing and dance and play basketball. So why would you want to pass up on an opportunity to be with somebody who reminds you of Chris Brown, be with somebody who reminds you of LeBron James, be with somebody who reminds you of... I don't know, Brian McKnight, whoever your favorite black singer is, right? Why would you want to do that for? Again, if you've never been with a black guy before, allow me to introduce myself. My name is The Good Doc, Dr. Mike TV. Now, if you go to Jollibee and you order the thigh and the leg, or you go to Monk Inasau and you order the PM1, you already like black guys and you didn't even know it. And you ask why? Because if you're not familiar, the thigh and the leg is already considered to be dark meat, baby. <laughs> it's already dark meat. So if that's your favorite part of the chicken, guess what? You already like black men and you just didn't even know it. And I'm just here to enlighten you, baby. I'm just here to open your mind just a little bit. Stimulate the intellect. And don't get me started on if it's true or not. Because I kind of feel like that's just a secret between you and the person you're in interacting and engaging with. But curiosity has always killed the cat. And trust me, curiosity with the good doc, good doc. <laughs> I'm likely going to kill that cat. I'm going to beat that cat. To... Stop. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. But let me get back to it, guys. If you have never been with a black guy, allow me to introduce myself. My name is the good doc, Dr. Mike TV. And I will be glad to render services as is. Again, I'm a real one. You understand? I'm black. I'm just black enough. You know what I'm saying? You might be scared of black men. You might not know what you're going to get when you get with one. But I'm going to tell you everything you're going to get when you get with me. Okay? I'm going to tell you everything you're going to get when you get with me. And it's going to be a whole lot, baby. Might be a little bit too much for you to handle, love. But I promise you, it'll be more satisfying that you could ever imagine i don't like to talk out loud because that's called bragging and i'm not fond of bragging i'll humble brag but i'm not fond of bragging but i promise you if you ever took a walk on the dark side baby you might be surprised about what you just might find <laughs> and i'm gonna leave that to the imagination love because again if you've never been with a black guy allow me to introduce myself i am the good doc dr mike tv and I will be glad to render services where services need to be rendered. All you got to do is sign on the bottom line. Comment section below. Call me. And we might be able to figure something out. Because again, the black experience is an experience like no other. And that's all I can say. At least on this side of the fence, love. At least on this side of the fence. And I know there's a little bit of apprehension. There might be a little bit of, oh, why would I want to be with the black guy? He doesn't necessarily look like the white guys. No shit. Um, I might be a little scared. Oh my God, what if he tries to rob me? It's okay, baby. I got my own money. It's okay. But you might think like, oh my God. Oh my God, what is this black guy going to do to me? <laughs> Will I ever be able to walk the same? I cannot guarantee that. Okay? I cannot guarantee that you'll be able to walk the same. But love, I promise you this. It'll be a night that you'll never forget. Okay? Because if you've never been with a black guy, allow me to introduce myself. I am the good Dr. Dr. Mike TV, and I will be glad to render services where services is rendered. Okay? And I want you to keep that in the back of your mind when you're thinking about people you want to choose for your future partners and stuff like that. If you've never given a black guy a try, instead of saying all of the reasons why you shouldn't, let's talk about all of the reasons why you should, love. Think about the reasons why you should. 
And I'm going to let you marinate on that one. You stay blessed. Doc is out. Peace.